your environment is everything. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me just run this back because I can't allow you to miss this. Your environment is everything. And it always wins. And as much as you think it doesn't have an effect on you, it has a tremendous effect on how your life turns out. And we all know the old saying, birds of a feather, they flock together. And the company that you keep has a major influence in how your life turns out. See, it influences by subversion. It's a silent killer of your dreams. And it's a normalization of being mediocre. Now they say, show me your five closest friends and I can show you your future. Now if you have five broke friends, guess who's going to be number six? If you have five complaining friends, guess who's going to be number six? And if you have five friends that don't want nothing for their life, guess who's going to be number six? See, the key is to surround yourself with people who fit your future, not the ones that fit your past. Now, this is a major key. Most people are going to miss it. It's going to go over their head. They're going to say they don't want to leave their old friends. And I have came to the conclusion, in my own personal opinion, the people that don't want to leave their old friends because they don't want to leave that old lifestyle. They love it. They're complacent. They don't want to grow. It's comfortable for them. See, Les Brown, he had a great phrase. He said, surround yourself with OQP. Now, OQP is an acronym for only quality people. That is it. That is the people you need in your life. And let me tell you this. If they're not better than you, get rid of them. If they don't support you, get rid of them. If they're not where you want to be or trying to be, get rid of them. Now, it takes being the bad guy. It takes being a bad person. It takes having that uncomfortable conversation. It takes you saying, nah, I'm going to work on myself. I'm becoming better today. And if they don't respect it, (laughs) then that's on them. That's not on you. Listen to this. Don't forfeit your future or your fortune to make somebody else happy. And I'm going to leave you with this. And this is a very important lesson that I learned from my mentor, Mr. Rome. He says, don't join an easy crowd because you won't grow. Go where the expectations and the demands to grow and to learn and to become more are high. So go out. I want you to grow and become the best version of yourself and find some quality people to do it with. Because I will either see you at the top or from the top. The choice is yours.